Hey there, welcome to a 4 Minute Friday, my weekly sales vodcast, where I take on a Friday just a few minutes to share with you a sales tip, strategy, tactic, or something that will help you make more sales. And as you can see, this week I'm sat in the garden, I've been out there having a coffee, it's a beautiful morning, so I thought I'd just shoot the video while I was here and while I was in the zone. And this week I want to share with you a quote from Sun Tzu. Now Sun Tzu is often uh, associated with, or his teachings perhaps I should say, are associated uh, with business and sales etc. So I wanted to share with you uh, this quote. Strategy without tactics is the slowest route to victory. So strategy without tactics, the slowest route to victory. Tactics without strategy is the fastest route to defeat. All right, so there's an important uh, message there for us if we run a business or we're in sales. It's okay having various tactics. I teach little tactics all the time. But as you heard me just say, you know, where I share strategies and tactics to help you make more sales because those two things go very much hand in hand. Now, strategy, you could, I, I guess, kind of relate to perhaps your sales process. Your tactics would be maybe more about your sales methodology. That's the things that you do at the various stages of your process. And your process is just one part of your business or your sales strategy. And the other thing to think about when it comes to strategy is a strategy should be ultimately supporting your uh, desired outcome. Comes back to my fundamental principles of sales, which is selling outcomes. Um, and in this instance, I said, you need to know what your outcome is. Now, if you're a professional salesperson, I guess you'll have a sales target, but you still need a strategy on how you're going to achieve it. Too, many, too often people are just tactically working on opportunities without thinking about their, their value, perhaps, to achieving the desired outcome and the fulfillment of that strategy. As a business owner, your strategy should start with your you know, revenue goals ultimately and or from a sales perspective obviously there's customer service and, and business development, uh, product development and, and all those other elements you will have to consider. I'm talking about sales but you need to know what is your sales goal. You know, what are you looking to achieve and over what time frame because that goal is going to define what your strategy is. So think about that. Don't forget you have to have a strategy and tactics and together those two things is what give, will give you ultimate power and can help you create differentiation in your marketplace because it will influence the way that you sell, not just what you sell. And this week I was training Adobe and, and this you know, came up a number of times. And you'll have heard me say it lots before because it's one of my kind of uh, kind of underpinning principles of success, which is the way you sell, not what you sell, can be a big differentiating. Your strategy and tactics will influence that. So don't have a gap in those, that capability by missing one of those two elements. So start with your strategy and then look at what tactics do you need to help you fulfill that strategy because that is what's going to ultimately give you the victory, as Sun Tzu calls it, and that you're ultimately looking for. So hopefully it's got you thinking on this beautiful Friday morning. I uh, hope you have a great day, a great weekend. The weather here in the UK anyway is promising to uh, stay very positive. It's been lovely uh, for the last few weeks. You can see the kind of grass is start, unfortunately starting to uh, suffer from the heat and the dryness, but I'm not complaining. We've had a very cold and wet winter, uh, so it's nice to have some sun and some great weather here. So, but obviously that's just UK. Wherever you are in the world, I hope you're having an equally great day. I wish you the best, lovely weekend, and more importantly, as always, I hope you have a fantastic week of sales and business next week, serving your customers, implementing your strategy and tactics, and achieving success. Take care. Bye-bye.